We are now back with our player of the game presented by JNF Construction and Development Inc. You already know who it is. Max Lauer playing big time tonight. 22 carries, 262 on the ground. I assume that's got to be right around a career high for you. You ran hard. You ran people over. Also pretty shifty when you had the opportunities. Break down for me tonight your game in the running game and why do you think he was able to be so effective? Uh, I think it's all my offensive line. They push people, they drive people, they dominate people, they give me lanes to cut through, and I was feeling my cuts tonight. We definitely noticed that, that the offensive line was able to produce some big holes, and you're not just a one-man wrecking crew. About four guys on this team can all rush the ball. How important is that to have different people be able to step up, carry the load at different times in the game? Oh, it's great. You know, it gives me a great, give everyone a break, let everyone stay fresh throughout the game. This was a Fredericktown team that had a little bit of momentum on their side coming into the contest, and you guys jumped all over them. I believe you were up 20 to nothing right out of the gates. Tell me about just the fast start here tonight, homecoming night, you know, probably a lot on your guys' mind, a lot going on this weekend, and just how cool that was to get off to the nice start. Oh, yeah, we were hyped. There are tons of fans here. Super great atmosphere. We were ready to play. Now that you got it done, you can go dance, do whatever you need to do tomorrow, but next week, Big game coming back here. East Knox, you know, a couple years ago, you guys were undefeated. They were undefeated. They they handled you pretty well two years ago, and then you went there and they knocked you off. What's it going to take to remain undefeated and knock off East Knox, that team that's just been taking you guys the last couple of years? Oh, we got a player game. We got a lot better this year than we were last year. And we just got to play. We got to stick to what we know how to do. We got to make it better. We got to have a great week of practice, and we'll play great. And uh, finally, just talk about what you've done, not only during the season, but during the summer. I know you beefed up a little bit. You were running people over freshman and sophomore year, but this year you've just gone to a next level. Uh, you know, conditioning was great this year. Conditioning coach Nate Hall, shout out to him. He's in Florida. Uh, he's great, putting together good workouts for us. Everybody's getting faster, stronger every day. And you mentioned that you feel like you're a lot better team this year. In what ways do you feel like you've taken the next step, got to the position where you're now undefeated past the midway point in the season? Uh, we have tons more experience, tons more experience. Uh, we've gotten a lot more athletic this year. we got a lot more faster, bigger, stronger. Everyone has, like I said. Well, you certainly showed that you were big and fast and strong tonight. Huge performance for you, 262 yards and a touchdown. Max Lauer, our MVP. Any shout-outs that you would like to give to anybody before we turn you loose? Uh, my mom, Heather Lauer. I love her. And my dad, who is here tonight. Fantastic. All right. Thank you so much for joining us. Max Lauer, our player of the game, brought to you by J&F Construction and Development.